To begin our practice, find a position that is comfortable, one that you could almost fall asleep in. You might be lying down on your left side. You might be placing one hand over your baby, over the center of your belly, placing pillows underneath you so that both your body and your baby's body are fully supported, fully at ease. Now let your eyelids become heavy and remind yourself that during this practice, you won't fall asleep. If you do, that's okay. The suggestions that I say during our practice will remain with you in your subconscious mind. But can you make an intention to stay awake, to stay alert, but to stay relaxed as well? Now just begin to listen to the sounds around you. Listen to the sounds that are far, far away from you. What is the farthest thing that you can hear? It might be the sound of wind moving through the trees. The sound of a car moving in the distance. The sound of a neighbor. Now start to draw your awareness a little bit closer in. Begin to focus on the sounds of the room that you are in. If there are people or another person nearby, notice what sounds that they are making. Notice any background noise. Maybe labeling it, but not necessarily judging it as a distraction. Just allowing it to be. And then take your awareness closer even now to your own body and to your baby and notice the sounds within notice the sound of your breath the sound of your heartbeat maybe imagine your baby's heart beating and now begin to notice your body You can imagine that there is a healing white light moving all the way down your body and all the way down your baby's body as well. As that light moves down you, it shields you. It acts as a protection so that within this bubble that you are creating, within this sphere of glowing light, both you and your baby can be safe. So imagine that white light starting at the center of your forehead and radiating up the forehead over the crown of your head and then down the back of your scalp, down the back of your neck. And let that light also move out from the center of your forehead over your brow line, over your eyes, letting the eyelids become even heavier now, over the bridge of your nose, cheekbones, your temples, your ears. Let that light move over the jawline, over your lips over your chin and then down the front of your neck let it move over the collarbones over the tops of your shoulders and then down your upper arms let that light move over your elbows over your forearms over the wrists palms of your hands the tops of your hands and down each of your fingers 
starting with your thumbs, then your index finger, middle finger, ring finger, and pinky finger, so that that healing white light has moved all the way through your fingertips. Let that healing white light move from the center of your heart around the back body, wrapping around the upper back, the mid back, over the front of your ribs, and then over your belly. Feeling it move over baby and just imagining each and every body part of your developing baby being protected as well. Let that healing white light move over your low back, your sacrum, around your hips, and into the base of your pelvis. And let the white light move over your thighs. Let it wrap around your hamstrings. Move over the knees over your shins, your calves, your ankles, the tops of your feet, the heels, your arches, balls of the feet, and down each of your toes. Moving through your big toes, your second toes, third toes, fourth toes, and fifth toes. And now every inch of your body and of your baby's body is protected, is shielded by this healing energy of the white light that is glowing within you. Now take your focus to the space just before your nostrils. The space where air begins to move into your body. Keeping your lips closed. Breathe in and out through your nose. And feel the connection of your nostrils to the air around you. Concentrate on that point as you breathe cool air in. And as you breathe it back out again. Now concentrate on your belly and the space around baby. Just letting the belly rise and fall with your breath. Feeling each inhalation and feeling each exhale. Imagine with your breath, waves moving up and down your body. You can imagine as you're breathing in, the cool edge of a tide washes over you all the way up to your belly. And then as you exhale, that tide moves down your body from the center of your navel all the way down into the tips of the toes and beyond. As you inhale, that white tide washes over your body, moving up just beyond the navel. And as you exhale, the tide draws back downward. Take a few breaths, visualizing the water moving over you, washing over your body gently, softly. And when it comes time to birth your baby, you can imagine this breath. You can imagine the downward energy with each exhalation as the water pulls down, draws your baby down as well but only when the time is right. Take a few more rounds of breath. 
Breathing in, feeling the tide moving up. And breathing out, feeling it wash away. And breathing in, the tide moves back up you. And breathing out, it washes away any tension, any worry, any fear, any stress. and your body becoming a little bit lighter now as if you're now floating on top of the tide or maybe instead you're floating in the sky on top of a fluffy white cloud whatever surface you're on let it be soft and let it hold your body and your baby as well and let your entire body become light. Now let your body become heavy, grounding yourself back down to earth, back down to the white sand. Or maybe you're on a pile of snow. Maybe you're a child making a snow angel, waving your arms overhead waving your legs. Let your body become heavier, sunken down into the earth that is supporting you and your baby. Now let your body become light again, floating into the sea, floating into the air, and let it become heavy, grounded in a wet pile of snow and then light, and then heavy, and light, and heavy, and then find a perfect balance of the two, neither too light nor too heavy, but just held in the center, held by earth, by the sky, by gravity. Now imagine your body becoming very cold, as if you are in a cool ocean, dipping your toes or maybe dipping the entirety of your body in. Feel that cool ocean surround your body. Or maybe you're in the snow again, making those snow angels, but this time, you're not wearing any clothing. Feel the snow upon your body and know that it is okay to be here as you are. Now imagine your body becoming very hot. Imagine the white flame of a candle. See that candle See it's melting wax. And imagine that that candle is very close to your body now. And it's not just one candle, but it's an entire circle of candles surrounding you, warming you, heating your body. In this moment, you are as hot as that burning white flame. Now let your body become cold again, feeling the snow on your bare skin. And let it become hot, feeling the flame. And then cold and hot and cold and hot and cold and hot now feel a balance between the two so that you are neither too cold nor too hot 
Your body is just right in this moment. The temperature is just right for you and for your baby. Now direct your awareness back into the center of your forehead, back into the space where that healing white light began. Know that that healing white light is still here protecting your body and protecting your baby. So you can let the thought of your body go in this moment and instead begin to open the screen of your mind's eye. Now begin a series of fast visualizations. Anything that comes to mind, let it come to mind without judging it, without intellectualizing it, without forcing it away. And if anything that I say does not resonate, does not sit well with you, just let that suggestion go and move on to the next. If you see nothing, that's okay too. Just allow your mind's eye to be open. Now imagine dandelion wishes an old cat's whiskers, a whisper in the wind, the sound of where, the smell of vanilla, a flower dusted apron, a birthday cake, a blank page in your diary, a wedding dress, an opal stone, jasmine, silk, and lace, crisp white wine, water at the edge of a tide, the glow of morning light, your grandfather's wrinkles, your favorite baby blanket, a pillow fight, feathered wings, fluffy white clouds, the feeling of floating, an angel in the air, catching snowflakes on your tongue, marshmallows melting in your mouth, the smell of fresh laundry, snow-capped mountains, your mother's smile, steamed milk, a star in the night sky. Now imagine that star in the night sky. Notice how it looks. And let yourself be watching it from the vantage point of a desert. You are in a desert just after the calm of a desert storm. The sky is dark. The full moon is out, and that full white moon is shining light down on you and on your baby as well. The light of the moon is healing, is protective, is your shield just as was that glowing shield that we drew around ourselves. Underneath the light of the moon, you and your baby are safe. Now in this safety, you begin to dance. You begin to dance around the desert earth. You begin to dance to the beat of a rattlesnake moving, as if that rattlesnake is your drum. You begin to dance among the cacti, 
among the white desert roses, finding your own rhythm, finding your own beat, finding your own sense of movement. Now imagine how it feels to dance in this desert. Imagine how the cool air of night, the dry air of the desert, feels upon your skin. You continue to dance into the night for as long as your body chooses to. Again, in this moment, you are safe. And in this moment, you feel free. Now, when your body becomes tired, your body tells you that it is time to rest. You find a place to sit. You see a white dove in the distance. And you follow that dove beyond the fields of cacti. Beyond the dryness of the land into a waterfall. And at first you begin to wonder if that waterfall is just your imagination, if it's just a mirage. But the waterfall is real. You open your hands into the cool water and you feel it upon your skin. And in this moment, you bathe in the waterfall. You drink from the waterfall. You are refreshed. You are replenished. You dance a little more in this cool water, feeling your body floating now. And then when you are ready to come back to land, you find yourself a seat upon a million feathers. White feathers have been laid out neatly, nicely for you to sleep on and for you to birth your baby on when the time is right. Through the night, you are protected still by that moonlight. You and your baby both are. You are safe to let your body do what it instinctively, intuitively knows how to do. To allow your baby to move outward. You see a white desert rose nearby and you follow what that rose is doing, opening. opening to the possibility of life. And when the morning light comes, when the warm, glowing sun begins to rise, begins to create a painted pink sky, your body has done everything that it needs to do. And you are no longer one. You are two. You and your baby. You and your baby are here in the desert, now protected by the glowing white warmth of the sun. Imagine how it feels to be holding your baby in your arms. Imagine the feeling of your baby's skin upon yours. Look around you to the nature that you see and now know what a 
it's not just your own eyes seeing this nature, seeing this beauty. Now, you can show all of this beauty, all of this possibility, all of this magic in the world to your baby. So you see the world anew now. You see the world through your baby's eyes. Magical. Filled with light. Filled with potential. Now know that this can be a reality when the time is right. When the time is right to birth your baby, your body will know just what to do. When your baby arrives, you will know just what to do. To hold your baby and show them the world. But for now, the sun has risen and it's time to return. So you make your way back into your body, into the room that you are in, into the space that you were in when you closed your eyes. Now you can still feel that glowing white light protecting you and your baby. And it can remain with you if you choose. But for now, as you land back into your body, the image of that desert, of the moonlight, of the morning sun, begins to fade. Wiggle your fingers, your toes. Open your eyes and become wide awake.